Hey everyone, what's up? This is Blaze. Welcome back to another Dragon Spire Fishing Episode 2. In Episode 1, we started doing the quests and finished a good amount of them. Learned about Sentinels and all that stuff from our master, Yuri, over there. But uh, before we actually get started with this, um, I completely failed on this video because I originally started recording um, a different time, like 20 minutes ago. And I ended up going for like 15-20 minutes through the video and I realized that after 15 minutes of fishing in one area I realized that I was fishing in the wrong area because we have to go for the amber parrot and the trigger fish so I was going for the amber parrot in the plaza of conquest which let's be honest I don't even like the plaza of conquest and that fishing area is pretty bad so I started off fishing in the Plaza of Conquest for the dang uh, parrotfish and yeah obviously there's no parrotfish there so we're gonna start off this episode in the right area which is the Tower Archives I think I mentioned at the end of last episode that we had to go here but I don't know I just somehow thought that the triggerfish or not the triggerfish the amber parrot was in the Plaza of Conquest which it definitely wasn't <laughs> okay uh, we have a pond over here that I can go check out. Um, wow, there's a lot of these guys here. Rock Reavers. Rocking the Mystic Skiff because I'm feeling feeling like we need some uh, Skiff action going on to be inspired in Dragon's Fire. Did we fish here before? I, I swear we fished here before. I think we may have. Uh, let's go reveal. So, I'll probably end up using a potion because... Yeah, kind of ran out. Well, that's a good spot. Too bad I can't go. Wait, can I go here? That'd be awesome if I could go right here. Oh, I can't. Dang it, they're in such awkward locations for fishing. I wish this thing wasn't here. Kind of blocks it. So it's a rank two. The amber parrot is rank two fire. I didn't really see if this fish was fire 100%, but I saw that there's some fire in here, so. We're just going to go for this. Hopefully, like, a few of these are fire. And that we can catch this ember parrot. But here's the thing. We don't only have to catch one ember parrot and one trigger fish. We have to catch three of each. So, could be a struggle here. That is that is a fire fish, but it's not the right fire fish. Okay, if my pet casts the may cast thing, dang it. That would have kind of made my, uh, my day so far. Let's go ahead and check the waters over here. The waters, the lava, the lava pits. I can kind of see there's a fish there. But I have no idea if it's actually fire. Both the fish that we're trying to catch today are fire. We'll see how how lucky I am in catching these. Well, we are getting lucky with uh, the fire fish, but not really on the right type of fish. So many firefish. Look at this. Such a good chance. What if all of these were ember parrots? That would be perfect. And there we have it. Finally, our first ember parrot fish. That took a while. Those things are fairly difficult to find in here. I didn't have to resummon the pond yet, but we were getting low on firefish here. So, the Amber Parrot, one of the most colorful fish in Dragon Spire, both in appearance and disposition. The Amber Parrot never passes up an opportunity to speak their mind. It's pretty brightly colored. So, what kind of the Amber Parrot? Wow, I love how the other one that was fire just immediately swims all the way to the opposite side of the pond, so I can't catch it. That is great. I'll probably end up resummoning this pond because it's kind of out of fish. I'm gonna go check this other side. But yeah, kind of a struggle to catch these things. I caught a lot of other firefish and didn't find an ember parrot. Maybe I was just unlucky. But yeah, there's no more fish here. So we have two more to catch. Um, I'm gonna hope in, that I get lucky and uh, find them quickly. But yeah, we'll see. I'm going to probably resummon the pond here. That is the wrong button. Resummon. 
I have a good amount of energy, and even if I run out, I'll probably just buy another elixir. Because we need to catch all these fish for Yuri. Yes! We did it! <laughs> we got the last Amber Parrot. Wow, that... That, my friends, was a struggle of a quest. Three Ember Parrots. Do not underestimate the uh, elusiveness of the Ember Parrots. So if anyone else is on this quest, and they're kind of like wondering where the best spot is to catch these things, I was up here near Petrov's Tower in this pool, and I caught two here. I caught two in this pond, and then I caught one like towards the, the beginning somewhere. I don't remember exactly where it was. But yeah, I would go here, because most of these fish are fire, and there's some sentinels, but I just scared them away with the banished sentinel spell. So yeah, that is a good spot to catch these parrot fish, which are super annoying. That took me so long that I was actually just looking up on like the wizard forums for where people were catching them and stuff. And uh, people said the parrot fish are a lot harder to catch than the, the trigger fish. So that is a good thing, but at least we got that one done. So now it looks like we have the trigger fish to go and try to catch these guys next. Now the Grand Chasm, let's head back to the Basilica. And I need to figure out where the Grand Chasm is because I have no idea which way I'm supposed to go. Oh, here it is, okay. Grand Chasm is right off the Athenium. I, uh, I don't know, the map was kind of messing me up because I was looking at the map and I'm like, oh, the Grand Chasm's here, it's kind of next to the Necropolis, but it's actually not. <laughs> it's actually not by the Necropolis. So, time to go and find three trigger fish. Man, this uh, this video, just catching six fish, is taking me a long time to record. I know I've, pro I've probably only been recording for, like, like the video is actually not that long, but it's taking me a while to be able to catch all these fish. Because there is a, you know, it is kind of difficult to find all these. So, Basically, it looks like the same strategy as the first. We got a bunch of fire here. And what we're going to do is banish the good old sentinels. Banish. And then we're going to start going for these firefish. There he is. There's that trigger fish from the Wild West. Triggerfish. He's rank two fire. Be careful when you're fishing in Dragon Spire, partner. Triggerfish has a quick temper and even a quicker draw. <laughs> I actually really like that description. Even quicker draw. There is Triggerfish number one. Now all we need is two more. And we will be good to go. It seems like I caught the first Triggerfish faster than I caught the first of the Ember Parrot Fish. So we're off to a good start. <laughs> oh my! Wow! Talking about moons? That took moons. Oh, I've never been happier to see a fish in my life. Well then. Oh my gosh, I've been in here for so long. That quest was probably one of the most difficult quests. That, at least fishing quests, definitely. Even like collect them good, if you think about collect them good quests, like, I feel like collect quests haven't even been that hard. Like finding the, like when you have to go in and like do a bunch of battles. Like usually you get the thing after what, three, four battles at most. Well, that took an extremely long amount of time. A lot longer than I wanted just to be able to catch six fish but they had to be like certain types of fish and to be honest those fish are probably kind of rare and uh, I think the trigger fish took me longer to catch it than the three the parrot fish so yeah Yuri you better give me some good stuff for that because that was the ultimate struggle you haven't caught all of the fish already have you bah! you win this round comrade 
That's an impressive haul. Thank you. But you're going to need an aquarium worthy of those magnificent dragon spire fish. I want you to have this dragon spire aquarium. Consider it your prize. Never let anyone say Yuri Smoke Snare is a sore loser. Now then, there are plenty more fish in the lava, as they say. The next fishing competition round will belong to me. You know, I think at the end of this episode, we are going to go and put those fish in the uh, tank because they deserve it. Those fish were pretty hard to catch. I mean, we caught one of each fairly easily, but catching like three of them, yeah, that was a struggle. So here you sell some more aquariums. What else do you sell? I don't really care about those spells. Wait, what was the thing in the middle? Oh, sell your fish. How many fish did I have? 95 out of 100. I'm close to having like a full bag for those. But what I wanted to do towards the end here is go to the labyrinth. Now the labyrinth is in the crucible. So let's go to the crucible. And we're going to go and get these new spells that one of the vendors in the labyrinth has because... They could uh, come in handy. That is the necropolis. That is that. Wait, oh, I meant the, ne the necropolis. Not the crucible, the necropolis. And then we're going to go over to the labyrinth. And we're going to go find this trainer. I don't think you have to fight anyone to do that. I hope not. Because that would be uh, kind of annoying. But yeah, we're going to head over to the labyrinth and grab these new spells. Because apparently there is a new fishing vendor in the labyrinth that has some new stuff that we could use potentially how much gold do I have in this guy oh plenty of gold because I know it costs a decent amount of gold to be able to buy these spells so let's go in the labyrinth and see if we can find out where this guy is it's in the map yeah there he is see this new fishing icon thing there I'm gonna head over to him there's also, you can also fish in the labyrinth. I'm sure there's labyrinth only fish that reside in here. Yep, I can already see sentinels and stuff. So, fishing spell trainer Timor. Is that your name? Oh, did not mean to click that. Train. Okay. Reveal the location of all rank 1 fish. Oh, well, that's kind of useful. Okay. So you can see where only the rank 1 fish are. And then these ones I've heard about. You scare away all except a certain school. So we're just going to get all these. They're only a thousand each. It's basically some advanced fishing spells. You know what? I'm probably going to use the one that is... Like say I want to... I know that the fish I want to catch is rank 2. I could just use the rank 1 fish thing. And then... Uh, let me look at my thing. I could just use that rank one fish spell and then I would know which ones were rank one and which ones were rank two or higher so yeah, that's this one right here so how do you how does it work oh that's interesting so what does the pit mean let me see where is the spell at again Reveal the location of all rank... Okay, so those are rank 1. If they have the pip thing over their head. Actually, no. What it's doing is it's only... So, whichever ones are highlighted by the spell are rank 1. The other ones are not rank 1. So, that makes sense. That is that spell. And then this one, of course, these all just scare away those fish. Except one school. So, if you're searching for one school, that'll make it easier to do. But, uh, let's go ahead and head back. I want to go to my uh, botanical garden to finish this episode off. This was a struggle of an episode, so uh, <laughs> it took me like a few hours to be able to catch all this fish, which is uh, kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. I'm gonna go with this one. Boom, fish, and we want ember parrot fish, which is an E. I think I passed it. Is it ember? Ember parrot, yeah. Ember parrot. And then we want, what is the other one called? Uh, the triggerfish T. Triggerfish? Really? Are you, are you actually kidding me? Only the emperor fish could go in there? What about this one? 
large. Can trigger fish go in here? Nope, apparently not. Well, we only have room for one fish, so the amber parrot is going to have to be in our aquarium right there. So that is going to do it for this episode. Might as well just pick this up. Uh, please leave a like if you guys have enjoyed because this video took a long time to make. I was actually going to record another video today, but I don't know if I'm going to do it now because this one took so long. But yeah, please leave a like if you guys have enjoyed this fishing episode. I'll probably be doing more. There's no more quests for fishing in Dragon Spire, but there are more fish to catch. So I'll probably just end up like deciding which fish I want to catch for the day. And see how many we can catch from Dragon Spire. So still more Dragon Fire Spire fishing to come. Stay tuned for that. Be subscribed so you know when that goes up on my channel. But other than that, hope you guys have an awesome day. I'll see you all next time.